Hey, what is going on, guys? This is DK. Back at you with another video here to talk about some prize picks, player pops I like for the NBA slate on 5-4. If you guys are new, welcome. My name is DK. I do make content for DraftKings, NBA Top Shot, and for prize picks. Um, if you guys are looking for more in-depth in in depth content for DFS, I do offer that on Patreon.com. We've had an absolutely amazing playoffs, and tonight I still cashed, even with an injury. Gary Payne getting injured in the first minute, and we still cashed in tournaments. So, it's been a phenomenal run here for us for DFS. Again, if you guys are looking for that, you can check out my Patreon link down below. I also cover esports and USFL. But, um, oh, and the sponsor of today's video, guys, is Super Draft, linked down below. You can use my discount code DKDFS for a $50 match on a $50 deposit. Um, so, again, that is linked down below. Super excited to, super excited to be working with Super Draft. Um, they do offer player pop contest as well as multiplier contest. So check them out. Use my discount code if you are a new user. But all right, uh, recapping the slate today. So one of one, um, very easily hit the Horford. Um, Bain was more injured than I thought. I thought I thought the sore back was just, you know, precautionary, but he looked pretty hampered by that. So that was, um, I think it was a mistake by me, just being a little bit overconfident and saying Desmond Bain is fine. He's totally not injured. Um, so I think that was just a mistake on my part, assuming he was he was full go because he played a good chunk of minutes still, but he was clearly, clearly not himself. So one of one, forgettable night. But um, yeah, again, they don't have the fantasy points up uh, yet for prize picks, but there's two picks that I do like. Uh, and the first one's going to be Jay Crowder over 15 and a half PRA. Now, as we talked about, the reason I took the over on Jay Crowder last night or the, the previous night was... Um, he had been shooting awful and had been in foul trouble and he had still, you know, been having solid games. And basically the same thing happened last game. He got in, in pretty severe foul trouble, lost a good chunk of minutes there in the third quarter, and he still had a solid game. Again, he's going to have open looks. He's a decent rebounder, can get some assist. So, um, yeah, I, I think I like the over here in Jay Crowder, assuming no foul trouble at 15 and a half PRA. And the other one we're going to go to on the Dallas side, um, and we're going to go to the over on Dorian Finney-Smith rebounds at five. So here's the thing. Dorian Finney-Smith is playing like 40 to 45 minutes a game. So he's basically out there the entire time. Uh, Dallas has shown they kind of want to go small. So Dwight Powell is not going to play a ton. Dwight Powell will probably be out there for about 15 or so minutes. You'll see Kleba out there for about 20, but Kleba is really more standing in the three-point uh, land. So you're going to see a lot of, you know, Doran Finney-Smith crashing the glass. Like, And they will close most likely with small ball lineup of Luka, Brunson, Dinwiddie, uh, Bullock, and Finney-Smith. So Finney-Smith at the five. So he's going to have some rebound opportunities. Again, he's going to play the entire game. So I like the over here on Doran Finney-Smith, five rebounds. So those are the two picks I like right now, guys. Um, but yeah, that's going to wrap it up for the video. So if you do enjoy this, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. Other than that, have a great night, guys, and I'll see you all in the next video.